Jinx if he's close enough. Just about set. Lights on. Ready here. 155. Sabon Panther. Let's see how she begins. They're ready. Racing. She hopped out pretty well. She's staying deep, so that's going to give her a great chance of leading, and she'll get over. Snowy Jinx was pushing hard and then copped a check. Around them comes Crown Sally. So Crown Sally now races past Sabon Panther as they go into the back. Sabon Panther just stalks the leader now. Two lengths away to Mai Tai Focus, so she's nice and handy. Three lengths away to Snowy Jinx trying to pick up again. Then Lady Bluebell and Stella Stone. Leader is Crown Sally, but here comes Sabon Panther. She's starting to get a little bit interested now. She railed underneath the leader and took the lead, running on from the back, Mai Tai Focus, but getting clear, Sabon Panther. Mai Tai Focus is running on well, but Sabon Panther uh, wins comfortably in the end. Second, Mai Tai Focus. Snowy Jinx got going late to get third. Then Stella Stone, Lady Bluebell, Crown Sally. Gave you a sight for your money early, but tired really badly and carved up to finish back towards the rear. Sabon Panther, number eight. Looked a good race for her on paper. She didn't have to lead. She just lobbed behind the speed and she was able to run past Crown Sally down the back and from that point on she was home. Number eight, Sabon Panther, Tony Nobes. Seven second, Mai Tai Focus. She's pretty genuine. She runs out of solid 6.40. She'll win another race soon. Number one, third, Snowy Jenks. He pushed hard that first corner and uh, he was probably sitting a bit closer than what I thought he would. He copped a check, so he had to balance himself again and then run on. So, look, he's not far away from a win either. Snowy Jinx, number three, got fourth, Lady Bluebell, the rank outsider. 38.45 the run, three lengths the winning margin by two and a half. It's 8.713, race five from Gawler.